Hello and welcome to our channel. On today's episode, I bring to you there was, it's not a good one, it's really a sad one. Uh, a train accident that occurred in Nigeria at, uh, I don't know what time exactly, but it was on the 9th of this month, March 2023. It occurred and from the news, it claimed six lives. And I bring to you, I mean, the video you can watch while while you listen to me is a video from a clip from, from the, I don't know if to call it first aid treatment, but I don't think that's first aid treatment. But that's the treatment, the victims, victims, those who are alive and those that were, you know, alive and severely injured. That's the treatment they are getting, you know, bringing mattresses on the floor, bringing out oxygens from the car. You know, I, I really feel, for me, in my honest opinion, I really feel we have gone past this level. Like, we are, for goodness sake, they call Nigeria the, the giant of Africa. We shouldn't be giving these people who, who escaped death, like, the, the injuries are very severe, and they get them treated outside on the floor like that. You want, I mean, to me, oh, I don't know, to me, I feel like we, this, this is not where we should be as a nation. This is not where we should be, but you can, the, 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 the comment section is open. You can comment, you can, you can let us know what you think about this video. Do you think it's right? Or do you think I'm wrong in, you know, and think, um, do you think I'm wrong in thinking that it is wrong to get them? You know, there are other hospitals. Why didn't they take them to other hospitals? Is that the only hospital? I mean, is that the only hospital that they have in Nigeria? Not in, not in Nigeria as a whole, but is that the only hospital that is available in that area? Or is that the only hospital that they can? I mean, the time they are using to bring all those mattresses and putting it on the floor, pulling out all those oxygen cylinders from, the, from one pickup like that, that time is enough for them to transport them to, the, to, to another hospital. Sometimes some death can be avoided. These things can be avoided. But people tend to risk, I mean, uh, please just leave your comment. Maybe I'm thinking too much or maybe I'm overreacting. I don't know, but I, I feel this has to do with somebody's life. You don't start putting mattress on the floor. What kind of treatment do you want to give outside for goodness sake? What kind of treatment? Is it better than when the person is inside? Look at all the masses. Look at all the people around it. You don't need all those stuff. Eh? Because that the, the the accident, as far as I know, the accident didn't happen close to like it's not in front of a hospital. It happened that you say you are just pulling people out of the out of out of the um, um the the train or out of the bus and putting them on the floor directly. That's not where the accident took place. They actually transported those people from from what I understand. They took them from a, the accident scene and took them to the, this this hospital. But for goodness sake, there are other hospitals. Even though let's assume this hospital is already crowded, no more bed, no bed space, but at least there are other hospitals where they can give them good treatment. What kind of treatment do you give to somebody lying down on the floor? Put it, you are busy transporting mattresses. I mean, looking at those ladies in uniform, you can see that they are nurses. That shows you that it's in the hospital. It's not like it's in the crime scene. or Not crime scene, sorry, the accident scene. So maybe I'm overthinking, but I leave the comment section for open for you guys. You can just comment, tell me what you think. Maybe I'm wrong in what I'm saying. Oh, I mean, we are here to learn. But for me, I think it's not right. But meanwhile, thank you so much for watching. If there's any other update, I'll let you know on this issue or on any other issue. Thank you so much and God bless you. We love you. Bye-bye.